Hmm? It was painful for mm -hmm. me, but now it is good. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, Vasif, are you afraid of a dentist's appointment? Mm -hmm. When you need to go see the dentist? I'm afraid of it when I uh, didn't mm -hmm. say... When I don't say about my problem with teeth for a long time, and after that it's very... Uh, Pain. Painful. Painful, that's the reason. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Often it's not painful. Mm -hmm. And usually you're not afraid. Mm -hmm. yes. Okay. So, Christina, have you ever complained about your doctor's visit? Uh, to my parents? Yeah, you said like, I will never go to this doctor again. He was cruel, he was rude, um, he wasn't nice, maybe. No, I think I have never complained to my mom about uh -huh. doctor's appointment. Uh -huh. What's the about you? Dentist, doctor, any doctor, any kind of doctor. Have you ever complained to your parents about some maybe bad doctor? You thought that this doctor was not very good? Mm. Mm. I don't remember when I... When mm -hmm. I Complained. Yeah. Mm -hmm. About doctor. Yeah. Yeah. All the doctors were good. Mm, yes. Uh huh. So okay, Christina, tell us when uh, do people usually need artificial? I can say you understand what it is. You remember what is artificial? What's it? Do you remember? Yeah. Artificial. Explain. Don't forget. Try to explain. Um. Like. Ah. Uh huh. Uh huh. You uh, remember. Uh, yes. <laughs> so what's up said like and you understood. <laughs> So, um, when do people need artificial hands? When they don't have a hand, mm -hmm. they need artificial hand. Okay, and what is it? For example, I do not know this word. Artificial, no, that's okay. Does it have to do with mm -hmm. art? Is it like it's a piece of art? <laughs> art you know, the art, artificial? Uh, it means that I can go to a museum with it, like this is art? For artificial. example, if you like animals and you don't need... Uh, mm -hmm. And you you need a fur coat. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But uh, you like animals, and you buy a fur coat with an artificial fur. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. <coughs> yeah, that's a good explanation. Okay. So, what's up? Tell me. How do we call a person who does something really bad and can be sent to jail for that to prison? How do you call that person? Criminal. And how do we call the thing that he does? Crime. Так, это Здравствуйте.